Shooting yeah. is not a crime. Yeah. Photo shooting is not a crime. So introduce yourself for the camera. So I'm the elk. Elk what? Elk Edu or uh -huh. Eduardo. Uh -huh. So I come from Spain but live here in Germany and Berlin. Uh -huh. And I'm ha just having fun here with our Kim. So can you tell us about uh, in German, what do you guys say when you're clicking the shutter? What is it? So people say to, to make a photograph, not to take it. So it's kind of more like a creative process, more than stealing something. And um, how do you think that um, people might have a different opinion if they're English versus German? So it, it's the fact that you say make something it is less aggressive than take something from someone. It's like shooting, you know. It criminalizes the fact that you are that you are taking photos. It's not not bad to take photos of people on the street. I don't know if there's any country where where it's forbidden but surely not in Germany and uh, it should not be called that way because it's not bad what we are doing out there so oh, that's very good so introduce yourself to the camera hi I'm Chris um, what's, what's your animal? my animal? Uh, yeah I'm the chimp the chimp? chimp Chris? chimp Chris and, uh, yeah. where, are you, where are you from? Chris? I'm Swedish mm -hmm. live in Switzerland uh -huh. and, um, here for the workshop with uh, Eric so how is the shooting street photography here in Berlin? It's good. Yeah. There's a lot of uh, variety, um, melting pot in terms of cultural um, diversity. We've been walking around uh, the third largest uh, Turkish city in the world. Um, <laughs> What's number two? Number two, I think, is Ankara. Istanbul is number one. Oh, okay. <laughs> And Berlin number three. So. Nice. Yeah, it's pretty and what's your what's your favorite thing about today so far? Um, the photo walk. Yeah. Nice. Introduce yourself to the camera. I'm Puma Peter. Uh huh. Puma Peter. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm from Austria. Uh huh. I came in from Vienna. Uh huh. And I'm here to to learn some new things about street photography and some tips and technical tips and also uh, creative tips. All right, so Puma Peter, tell us about what are some interesting tips that, or things that you learned today? Uh, some technical uh, tips, for example, to to shoot with, with ISO uh, 1600. Oh. Uh, this was very oh. new for me. Oh, 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 and from from the point of view of, of, of creative because uh, we this we I, I got the feedback on, on, on my photos which I did be, before the workshops and and they are not uh, uh, so good focused mm. focused on the moment uh -huh. and that is what I want to improve mm. uh, here in this uh, with these photo walks and with the whole instructions and with technical tips and with the creative tips. Nice one, Mr. Beckham. Introduce yourself to the camera. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm Thomas from uh, Cologne, and uh, this is my first Eric Kim workshop and my mm -hmm. first uh, photography workshop in general and. Um, Great time, great people, great beer, great. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> gotta love the Berliner. Now, this stuff's pretty good. Hey, who's this kid? Why is there a kid in the beer can? I have no idea. That's a little dangerous. Cheers. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cheers. 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 Product placement. Yeah, product placement. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, so tell us, tell us about coming to the workshop. Some difficulties you had when shooting street photography. Uh, yeah, I it was it was very very stressful to to get here, but. It was definitely worth it. Uh, I was in the car. With, <laughs> it was a shared ride with seven people. And the driver was very nice, Alexander. Shout out to Alexander. My yeah. Body uh -huh. uh, but it was like 11 hours. Although it was, oh uh, they, they promised to me that it was like a six-hour uh, drive. So um, it was quite, quite stressful to get here. Yeah. I got here last night at half past two. Mm -hmm. I got to my final destination, and today yeah. I showed up at nine o'clock on oh, time. Yeah. To, to get everything and yep to, to soak everything yeah. in and thus far great success so mr beckham when you're out shooting on the streets <laughs> um how, how have been people in berlin been uh, reacting 
Um, actually, because uh, the, the major uh, theme of the, uh, the workshop is conquering your fear. Uh -huh. And uh, my fear is, you know, that people punch me or they punch <laughs> me or they, they think I'm an asshole, but um, yeah. they have been friendly. And those people that, that don't want their picture taken, they just say, oh, no or fuck off so yeah but it, you know it doesn't hurt so if you just go all right and then you try you yeah. try your luck next time but you're so. pretty buff so you can beat up the people if they try to beat you up yeah i don't know, I don't know. <laughs> if they hit me at first and i would just you know no oh, right on right on all right introduce yourself to the camera hi i'm andreas from frankfurt and uh -huh. um that's my first eric kim workshop and my first street photography workshop and i just start building my confidence for shooting street photography. So what are some things you're concerned about in terms of shooting street photography? Um, my main concern is uh, keeping the confidence over the session and um, going close enough. And what are some things you learn to build your confidence when shooting street photography? Don't care about the people. Uh, don't care about people punching you or complaining. <laughs> just, um, <laughs> just shoot. Just shoot. Nice. Stay positive. Stay positive. Yeah. Good. Introduce yourself to the camera. Hi, I'm Claudio from Italy. Yeah, baby. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's why you're so stylish, huh? <laughs> Maybe, yeah. Uh -huh. Enjoying street photography uh -huh. uh, and beer, one may say. And beer. So how is shooting street photography uh, different here from compared to Italy? Uh, well, well, thankfully it's a big, big and colorful city. So uh -huh. you got so many, uh, I mean, opportunities. And you always have to, to look around you and the opportunity pops out and you go and shoot. Nice. And um, where you were you based in Italy? Where? Yeah, where? Ah, I'm based in Pescara, which is a small city on on this side. Mm -hmm. And you work right now as a doctor. How do you find your photography and your street photography connected with your interest in uh, being a doctor? Connects in, in the way that, uh, I mean, I'm exactly doing this to to improve my confidence to, to deal with people, to deal in a direct way with people and mm. with with, every, with, it, with their everyday life. Mm. Nice. All right. Introduce yourself to the camera. Hello, I'm Martin from Wuppertal. Mm -hmm. I'm a musician and in contrast to that, I'm not a street musician. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying <laughs> to, to make some street photographs. Uh -huh. um, pleasure uh -huh. and yeah. my biggest concern is maybe that I make people uncomfortable when I shoot them uh -huh. and uh, because as a musician I usually used to make them comfortable and feel well and so this is um, some kind of strange feeling for me to, to shoot someone who doesn't want it so usually the people come to my concert because they want to see me now I come to the people because I want to see them but I'm not sure they want to have that so when you're shooting in the streets how do you make people feel more comfortable yeah so this is a point I'm trying to learn here and um, I, I could see if you friendly and maybe if you're unsure you ask for permission and if they don't like that um, they tell you and so you stay away and have a positive attitude so maybe something like like on stage you have to have a positive attitude also you maybe some kind of have some kind of fear that something happens to you or some mistakes or so so just have a positive attitude also you maybe not feel too comfortable for yourself nice good advice introduce yourself to the camera hey i'm oliver i'm from zurich yeah baby and i'm a software engineer uh -huh. so i normally deal with machines uh-huh and today i had to deal with humans mm. so how's it dealing machine actually so how's it dealing with these humans you call them <laughs> yeah they're not that diff different from machines except oh, okay. for that they smile oh that is smile yeah. yeah yeah it's always nice no but I, well, one of my key takings from the workshop was that actually because i was a bit worried that people don't want their picture taken like everybody else yeah yeah uh, and what was really a surprise to me was like how many people actually smile at me after I took that picture. Mm. So, um, you know in Zurich, uh, have you shot a lot in Zurich? I have not shot enough in Zurich, no. I only got into photography recently and I'm pretty busy and traveling a lot. Uh -huh. So I wish I would have shot more. So where's the next place you want to travel to? Um, I'm actually in Munich in two days. Nice one! Go shoot those rich people, huh? Yeah. <laughs> nice one. 
introduce yourself to the camera. Hi, I'm John, and huh? I'm actually uh, the only real Berliner at this oh, table right oh, now. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah. So I'm a local, and yeah, shooting streets. So tell us more about Berlin. What's uh, what's uh, your your mayor said something interesting about Berlin? Uh, he once said Berlin is poor, but yet it is sexy, and I think this is very true. You have some very poor people, some cool locations, but yet it is cool, sexy, and beautiful. So what? So tell us what else makes uh, Berlin so unique from any other city in the world. Well, Berlin has so many different uh, sites, so many different like different parts, and like the so many different cultures in, at one place. And it's like, especially when you're shooting and photographing on the streets, it makes it really unique. Mm -hmm. And uh, what has been some of the most interesting things you've been uh, getting at the workshop so far? Well, maybe some techniques, how you can approach people um, in a way you can not alter the scene, so you can still shoot without asking permission, but yet you will not like piss them off, mm -hmm. and even if you do, how you can maybe react and um, like keep calm and make the situation. And uh, tell us what you love most about street photography. What I like, love most about street photography, well, um, capturing moments that are normally unseen for most people. So capturing moments that nobody sees except maybe me and my camera. Mm -hmm. Nice one. <laughs> and uh, show us your, your 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 case for your X100. So what makes it unique? Ooh, what is that? Your anti-chimp uh, device? This is my anti-chimp device. Uh -huh. No more chimping with this case. Uh -huh. Check it out. And who makes it? Like a time. Check it out. Like a time. Google it. Luigi. Leather. Italy. What do you want to say to Luigi? Great case. Great case? I nice one. Alright, wave to the camera guys. Alright. Peace out. <laughs>